sentiment. Now it's time for the weather. And Tim Noonan's in Morford Vale preparing for our hottest Christmas in nearly 30 years, Tim. Oh, the Santa sauna continues, Jane, all the way to the big day, with a storm and potential fire bands thrown in interrupting plans. Here in Simone Crescent, they can't wait for the sun to go down, because they shine after dark, and have done for a decade. All 40 houses have lit up for Christmas this year, except for one. Oh well, there was three last year. They don't let it cast a shadow, they focus the spotlight on fundraising for Flinders Medical Foundation's cancer research, and they raised $16,000. We got just over the forecast 34 in town. Wait till tomorrow, Santa. It was a classic morning, the low of 16.8. It's now 30, 31. Mostly hot and dry around the state. There were showers in the far west. Again, a coldish start in the southeast, but the CFS warns a high fire risk expected there from hot northerlies over Christmas. The high pressure that's staking out the Tasman is going to turn the torches on us over the next two days. And the storm front that could mess with Christmas is looming southwest of WA. And the first cyclone of the season is possibly forming on Christmas Day southeast of Darwin, but it's not expected to hit populated areas. A slight chance of thunderstorms in the far north and west of SA, otherwise getting serious about the heat. 36 for Clare and Sejuna, 38 in Kadena and Strath, 39 for Murray Bridge and Pirie. And there are fire bans in these three districts. It's highly likely there'll be more for the big day. We'll let you know the latest tomorrow night. Our metro waters are calm before the storm, variable winds up to 10 knots, a bit stiffer later in the evening and seas below a metre. The top's now 38 for Christmas Eve in the city, the low is 17, hot and sunny. Then, our hottest Christmas day since 1986, 37 degrees before the cold front hits late afternoon. The winds will then be gusty southerlies and the temperatures could slide like Santa down a chimney, even below 20. Everything seems okay for now in the glow of Simone Crescent's lights, will be even better after 8.30. Come and roll a coin for cancer research and uh, maybe sort of send some Christmas love to the single house on the street that doesn't have any lights, Jane. Mm -hmm. Indeed.